21 to 25 review number one part a so these first three problems here are asking us to identify limit information about the function f as we are approaching a from various locations so here if we look at this one this says what are the y coordinates getting close to as x approaches a from the right hand side so to answer this, we will locate A on the x-axis, move a little bit to the right, hop up on the curve, and then move along the curve until we're directly over A. When we do that, we look to see what the y-coordinate is. Notice that the y-coordinate at that spot is 4. So the answer to this question would be 4. This next one says, what do the y's get close to as x approaches a from the left hand side? So again, we locate a, move to the left, move up to the graph, and then travel along the graph until we're over a, and again ask what are those y coordinates equal to? They're getting awfully close to 4. So my second answer would be 4. Now since these two numbers are exactly the same, the two-sided limit, or this one, which says what does f approach as the limit, or excuse me, as x is approaching a from both sides, that is going to be 4. Because if I hop on the curve to the left and right of a, move along the curve until I'm over a, we can see from both sides that we are approaching that y-coordinate of 4. The next three deal with b, so same picture, only now we are approaching an x value of b from the right, from the left, and from both sides. So let's do the right one first. If I look at b and move to the right, hop on the curve, and then move along the curve until I'm directly over b, we can see that the y coordinate that belongs with that is a 3. So the answer to this would be 3. If I want to approach B from the left side, I again locate B, move to the left, hop on the curve, and now I move along the curve until I'm over B. Notice this time that my Y coordinates are closer to 4, so my limit on that one would be 4. Looking at these two numbers, we see that the left, excuse me, the right hand limit is 3, the left hand limit is 4. These two numbers do not match. So the two-sided limit does not exist. We can see that in the graph because I have two different branches. If I try to hop on both sides and move toward B, my fingers are going separate places. They are not joining together. 